Hi everyone, this is just a quick demo on how to do the balloon pour or a dirty pour with the balloon. So I've added my colours in there, a few drops of um, silicon oil as well as mixed with Floetrol. I've got metallic gold, white, a metallic aqua, I believe, and uh, or teal, sorry, and a navy blue. So I'll just, you can use anything you like as a palette. My cute little dog wants to say hello. Okay, so there's the colours I'm working with just as an example. And I've blown up the balloon, so it's to about this size, nothing bigger. And all you do is pick a spot in the area of the paint, dab it lightly, so you end up with that, and press lightly onto the canvas. I like to wipe the balloon each time I do it, so you don't get the remnants of the previous one. Get some dark blue in there. The dog. Hi everyone, this is just a quick demo on how to do the balloon pour or a dirty pour with the balloon. So I've added my colours in there, a few drops of um, silicon oil as well as mixed with Floetrol. I've got metallic gold, white, a metallic aqua I believe and uh, or teal sorry and a navy blue. So I'll just, you can use anything you like as a palette. My cute little dog wants to say hello. Okay, so there's the colours I'm working with just as an example. And I've blown up the balloon, so it's to about this size. Nothing bigger. And all you do is pick a spot in the area of the paint, dab it lightly, so you end up with that, and press lightly onto the canvas. I like to wipe the balloon each time I do it, so you don't get the remnants of the previous one. Get some dark blue in there. the dog. Okay, just continue and I'll show you up close what they look like. Obviously you can use any colours you like. Let's clean the balloon a little. Go for a bit of gold this time. Just like that, and when you use a pencil, I just try to find anything with a flat surface for the smaller ones. So just dab. Try to find interesting colours. Dab like so, and the marker. Just make sure you've got the colours you'd like on it. Dab. Obviously that won't come out as interesting as the balloon. But I've also used a ball. My nephew's ball. Before I tried the balloons. You get the same kind of effect. Not as good as the balloon. But still interesting. But you've got to be careful of when you do that with the ball. I'll try one more. You can do it on a black background, any sort of background you like. You paint it first. The other one I did, which is still drying, was on a 
painted black canvas panel. I need to clean it up a little around the edges, but that's how it turns out. It's quite fun to do it. So if you have any questions, let me know.